Well, local taxi drivers say fewer calls are coming in. The reason is Uber. It's a ride-sharing company through a smartphone app. And with a push of a button, anyone can request a driver and watch their driver on a map until they arrive. Well, WSBT Suzanne Spencer is following this story tonight. Suzanne. When Uber drivers started their service in South Bend, taxi companies said they didn't feel an impact. Now, nearly a month and a half later, they noticed a big drop in business, and they aren't so happy that Uber is here to stay. Philip was one of the first Uber drivers in South Bend. The same day they launched the program in South Bend, I'd have to really have to sacrifice my standard of living if I didn't do it. I took a ride with Philip, who works five days a week and is one of at least seven Uber drivers in South Bend, a number that is growing, according to a spokesperson from Uber. Philip says many of his passengers prefer Ubers to taxis. Because it's a more competitive service. I mean, they feel like they get a, a better deal. But not everyone feels that way, including Arthur no. Forbes, who's worked no, for Blue Ribbon Taxi for years. He says Uber is taking passengers away from the taxi business. There are nights that we think it should be a little busier, and there might be a few less calls. Because Uber's business model is different than a traditional taxi, they don't have to undergo as strict of training as taxi drivers or be licensed by the city, meaning they are held to different legal standards than taxis. And Forbes says that is part of the reason for the difference in prices. They found the only loophole to get in. And even though the city doesn't regulate Uber the same way it does traditional taxi companies, Kara Kelly with the city of South Bend says, we believe there's a strong local market for both Uber and traditional taxi services. Well, Suzanne, it's been a pleasure. Suddenly, a ride across town comes with a few more choices. Blue Ribbon Taxi is just one of many local cab companies who use a similar sm smartphone app as Uber's. And in their app, it's called Flywheel. You can download that app and request the nearest taxi without making a phone call. At the live desk, Suzanne Spencer, WSVT, Channel 22 News.